As requested, I have been in Area 51 AMA. I am writing this for my mom's boyfriend who we live with, Stephen Gorvan who has in fact been in Area 51. He was there testing the Mars rover. He is the chairman and co-founder of Honeybee Robotics. How much of it did you see? How was security compared with a regular military base? Did you see anything unusual or unexpected? I saw a lot of it. It's a big place. I was driving around probably for 25 miles. I think it was from the southwest gate. Security was effective but light. In other words there were civilians outside the gate with lawn chairs and telescopes, but they didn't get anywhere near getting inside. But I had a pass. Yes. I saw a strange, it wasn't just me, two of us saw a strange aircraft flying low across the desert floor, and it went up and over these mountains that were in front of us. We figured it was a test flight of a secret aircraft. Based on what you saw of the low-flying aircraft, how many decades away would you estimate we are from hoverboard technology? This is an important and serious question. Probably pretty damn close. Area 51 has a gift shop? Yes. Except for aliens, is there anything else Area 51 is involved with? Testing. It's like a test range for the military and other government agencies. Other government agencies. Any one agency specifically? Well certainly NASA is the one I'm sure of. JPL and those are the only ones I'm sure of. Well and probably at least one university, but I'm sure there are more. What's one thing can you tell us about Area 51 that we don't know but should? I would say probably how truly vast it is and how remote, despite the fact that it's in the USA, it's so remote. What is the most interesting fact you know? Let's just get straight to it. And I mean interesting as in. I can't believe that that is true. That the size of the apparent disk of the moon in a solar eclipse is the same exact size as the sun. There is no reason why that should be. Is it mainly underground or above ground? I didn't see any underground facilities. It's mostly desert and I was out in the desert. What part of the Mars rover was he involved with? In other words, what field is he a genius in? It was for the RAT, rock abrasion tool. He was a member of the Mir science team. We were controlling it from JPL and pretending Area 51 was Mars. Have you seen anything significant that you are not allowed to talk about? At Area 51? No. Will you really get shot if you cross the gate into Area 51 with no warning? Or are there warning shots and people who come and get you out arrest you? I don't know what the nature of the security was if I tried to break in. What does an Area 51 pass look like? Do they have a secret handshake too? No, our name was on a list and our NASA badges got us through. What was running through your head when you heard you were going to be working there? Whether you believe any of the rumors or not, there are still a ton of them. I thought it was very cool. I was looking forward to it. Do the people in A51 make fun of the alien thing? Like joke posters or UFO things? I hope people in Area 51 don't make fun of Reddit and call it the alien thing. Did you get to go inside Hangar 18? No I don't think I went inside any buildings. The crew was there for two weeks and I camped probably half of that time. The other half I drove into a town in Nevada and stayed there, I forget the name of it. I drove like 90 miles at like 100 miles per hour, no speed limit. How many women worked at Area 51? A few, probably about 10%. Do you think that the government has made contact with aliens, but are afraid of chaos if they acknowledge it? No. It's possible, but I don't think so. What was the name of Area 51 when you went? Did they have an official name for it? You're going to be working in Area 51 or what? It may have had another name, but we all knew it was Area 51, and that's what we called it. Could you ask him I'm in a technical field as well, CompSci? 
How do I increase my creativity so I too can found a robotics company someday? Don't take no for an answer. Persevere. Keep coming back for more. That's the secret actually. Most people give up. How do I value myself and continue to develop when I can see the infinitely better people out there better than me at what I do? Because most people, even people that you think are smarter or more creative than you will give up. If you persevere people will stop being your competitor and before you know it you'll be the only one left standing. Did you ever feel like you were being personally watched by any surveillance just because of the level of clearance? I never felt I was under surveillance. What's your view on the Roswell UFO incident? Edit, grammar. I think it probably was the government, but they're not telling us the whole truth of what they were doing. How many people actually know the truth there? Is it constrained to just a handful, or is it a secret protected by thousands, the CIA, FBI, NSA, etc.? In other words, how large is the cover-up? If there is one I would bet it has to be small, otherwise somebody would spill the beans. If you could go to Mars in the remaining years of your life, knowing you could die, be it while traveling, or on Mars itself, would you do it? No. I'm an Earthling. 